I just want to start by the, by the mission dates to say that following an invitation that I received from the government of Israel to first handedly, I quote, hear and see the testimonies and evidence of these heinous acts of conflict-related sexual violence, I led an official visit to Israel from the 29th of January to the 14th of February. And I was supported by a technical team with relevant expertise such as a forensic pathologist uh, and a di digital and open source information an analyst, in addition to specialists in the safe and ethical interviewing of victim survivors and witnesses of sexual violence crimes. Uh, I must stress that my mission was neither intended uh, nor mandated to be investigative in nature. This is a mandate vested in other UN bodies. Uh, prior to the mission, the scope and parameters of the visit were agreed in advance with the Israeli authorities, the object, uh, objective being to gather, analyze, and verify reports of conflict-related sexual violence related to the Hamas-led terror attacks of 7th of October and in their aftermath in order to inform reporting in the exercise of my mandate, including to the U UN Security Council. Considering that uh, prior to the mission, I had received uh, reports uh, allegedly committed by Israeli security forces and uh, settlers, one of the parameters of the visit which I insisted upon with the government of Israel was a visit to the occupied West Bank to engage with the Palestinian authorities, civil society organizations, release detainees and other relevant actors, and to raise these allegations with the Israeli government, which, to which they agreed. 